what is going on guys welcome to another video in this video i'm going to be sharing my top 11 gym essentials these are things that i love and use and most of the time i take them to the gym with me so i just want to share them with y'all and for everything that i mentioned i will try to leave a link below in the description so if you want to check out some of this stuff check out the video description down below but i'm not going to waste your time let's get straight into it with my number one gym essential and that is these jcv wireless headphones if you can focus so these right here i love they come with this little charging um thing you just plug it into the computer and this is the headphones right here my mom actually got me these for christmas i love them and man for the longest i didn't even use wireless headphones and it was a struggle i don't know what the heck i was thinking i remember they used to get caught on the stuff and it was just it was so irritating so shout out to my mom for getting me these headphones because <laughs> they are a game changer you definitely want a good pair of headphones when you're working out and i also wanted to mention with these the battery life is pretty dang good i can go probably the most i've done is i'd say about three days of not charging them sometimes i do use them at work and stuff like that so um, you get a good amount of battery life with these headphones. All right, so the next thing I want to talk about is my favorite pair of shoes. I love these shoes, and that is these Adidas Focus. These Adidas Ultra Boost. It's probably blown out. Um, I love these shoes right here, man. Ultra Boosts are super comfortable. Now, they are pricey. I think these were... I think about 200 bucks so they do cost a good amount of money but i am a believer and you get what you pay for these are hands down the most comfortable probably the most comfortable shoe i've worn and man i just love these shoes um you definitely want a pair if you've never got a pair of ultra boost you definitely need to get a pair and my third gym essential is these lifting straps right here focus i've had these for a long time man and they've never failed me and as you can see they're actually wrist straps too it's not just straps um you get good support on the wrist so i like that it's a two-in-one um you know sometimes for your pressing movements if you're going pretty heavy your wrist can you just want state more stable wrists um and less chance of injury so i do like that i don't have to switch out my straps and i can just tighten the wrist part of these um, but I could also use them for back day because they are straps so it's kind of like a two-in-one um, I got these off Amazon a long time ago and um, yeah really good all right and the next essential I have right here is these wrist uh, wraps right here by primal elite I love these right here now I know I just said I'll use the other one sometimes but for my chest days I do I do like to use these sometimes just because they don't have the actual strap just kind of out and all in the way and stuff like that so just a cheap pair of wrist wraps but they do the job all right guys the next essential i have right here is this hydro gallon man i love this thing i'm super serious about my water i actually just love water and uh, making sure i get a gallon in every single day so this helps me achieve those goals um i've had this for about a month i started my cut about a month ago um i had another one but i just wanted to upgrade and I love this one. It has this um, sleeve thing. So you can take this off. I'm trying to do that. You can take off the sleeve if you want. It has this cool little strap. So uh, just carrying strap. Um, it has a handle as well. I actually use the handle a little bit more. The handle right here. And um, I think it has like a little phone thing. Yeah, so you can put your phone in this part right here. Um, pretty cool. I love it. It's not... The cheapest water bottle thingy but if you want something that's quality you can't go wrong with this all right guys and next up we have this belt this training belt by grizzly fitness as you can see the logo uh, man i've had this belt for a long time back in the day i use this belt a lot i don't use it as much now but i just have it just in case um, so if you're doing some heavy squats thing, things like that you want some extra you know back support you just definitely want a lifting belt. I feel like if you work out, you just want a lifting belt. Um, and this one right here does the job. All right, next up, guys, I have the squat wedges. So, and I'm just showing one of everything. It comes with two. Um, I forget the brand. Well, it says double circle. I love these things right here. I got these from Amazon. Actually kind of heavy. What I use these for is my leg days. I don't know if you've seen people before putting the plates under their feet. They're trying to emphasize... 
um, you know, the quads and things like that by elevating their heel. I don't like doing that. I like the squat wedges. I feel like they're more stable. Um, and these are also good if your ankle mobility sucks and it's just hard for you to get depth with your squats and things like that. You definitely want to get some squat wedges. Um, they definitely help. Next up, guys, we have these SVD knee sleeves. I wear a size large for anybody that's wondering. I've had these for a long time. I got these when I first started lifting and I use them on my leg days. Uh, sometimes, you know, I'm getting older. Sometimes the knees, you know, <laughs> are aching and things like that. So having some knee sleeves helps. I feel like it just kind of warms my knees up and they feel a lot better. Um, so you definitely want something like this for your leg days, especially if your knees just kind of ache a little bit. Um, some knee sleeves can help with that. And the next thing is these SBD elbow sleeves. So I got these with the knee sleeves. SBD is a good brand. I'm not even sure if they're still out there, honestly, because I got these a long, long time ago. But, um, you know, maybe your elbows, you got a little elbow pain, getting old, got some elbow pain, get you some elbow sleeves. I don't use these as much anymore. Um, it just depends on how I'm feeling on like my pressing type days. If I feel like I need a little bit more um, support on my elbows, then I will use these sleeves. Pretty dang good. All right, and the next thing, guys, is this attachment right here. It'll focus, you can see it's pretty long and it has these openings right here. Um, I use this for a lot of different things and I got this off Amazon, it's not expensive. Uh, but I use this for my arm days. You can use it for back movements like pullovers, face pulls. So I feel like I, it's a lot of versatility with this attachment or piece right here. And I just like how the handles feel. Um, I just like this a little bit more than using the rope for certain exercises. Uh, just the handle on it just feels more natural and better. Um, so it's a good piece of equipment if you're looking for something different for your arm days, um, face pulls, pullovers, and things like that. And the next thing I want to show y'all is this Joby um, tripod. I've had this for a long time too. You know that content creation is really big right now. Um, if you just need something to set your phone up on, this is a really good tripod and you can actually attach it to stuff. It's really strong. So if it's something near and you want to kind of set it up on that, it'll stay on that because these legs, you can just kind of wrap it around that specific thing. So if you're a content creator looking for a small tripod that is, you know, good quality, you definitely want to check this out. And the last thing I want to show y'all is this gum right here. <laughs> I felt like I had to throw this in and I feel like I should have thrown in deodorant too, man, because I'm not trying to talk about people, but some people pass by you in the gym and they smell really, really bad in some people's breath when they're kind of in your area smells really, really bad. Um, but you just want to make sure, man, you have good breath. This ice breakers gum is the best. I think it's Arctic grape. I love this. Um, my wife loves it. What's another flavor? I think it's uh, watermelon. We like the watermelon too. So get you some gum, guys. I love chewing on gum. I don't want my breath stinking. Uh, I don't want my body stinking. Like I said, I should have put deodorant in this list too, but you get what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Those are my top 11 gym essentials. Leave a comment down below and let me know what are your favorite gym essentials or things that you take to the gym with you a lot. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like, subscribe for more fitness content, and I'll see y'all in my next video. Peace.